Good morning. Welcome back to my genie bottle. Um, I finished layout. Worked on this yesterday in a three-part video sesh, and I finished it. So I'm happy with it. I found a final resting place for those guys and stuck them down using what adhesive came on it. They they do this sticker set secures well. And I've not found it upon returning to any sort of page with these on it ever to have any of these ever to have come undone. So I like that. So I didn't use additional glue. I used what was on them originally. And I like it. And then I used hot glue to secure the bows. And then I did my journaling with this pen. This one. Where's the label one wonders? Anyway, it works well. It skips a little, no big deal, because there's a little texture there on that sucker. Um, and when I was done writing on there, when I was done writing, I just put paper on it and rubbed it so that I just used paper to rub it to try to get off any additional ink so it doesn't transfer, because I have noted that there's transfer of that ink onto the onto the opposite page. Um, I don't like that, but we'll see. I think I dried it well. Um, I used, not that it shows up, but I used this stuff to put the journaling in. It's hyper sticky, I love it. Um, to put the journaling on, it's only like an eighth of an inch. I don't know that it really shows. Let's secure that with a little more, a little more ATG action, shall we? I gotta sit got to sit down to do it. Anyway, so I ordered a new album and it arrived. And um, it arrived. And I'm going to open it and maybe put these in it. I don't know. We'll see what I think. If you've seen any of my videos yet, you've heard that I like a, a closed album. But I wrestle with the fact that there's not much space within it to scrap. So I ordered an open open binder and it arrived and I'm going to see what I think. It is humongous. It is, oh, also Pioneer. I like Pioneer albums. Yes, I do. I do. Okay. So, what do we think? We have the, oh, it smells good. I gotta smell this. Oh, that smells good. It smells like a uh, paint. Very nice. Okay, so this should give me some space to do some things. I asked Shamel during live today, which is when I finished that layout. I asked her, I might say that actually. I asked her about putting these albums on vertically on the shelf. And it, did she do that with the open binder like this? And she said, yep. And I was like, how do you prevent your pages from sagging and hanging on the rings? And she said, quality page protectors. <laughs> I was like, you know, that's blooming brilliant right there. I like that little window. So we have those windows to, to do. All right, then. Uh, I've never used anything like this in my own, in my own albums. I've made, I've made some for my sons and stuff. Let me try to adjust this a touch. I've made some for the, my sons that were in three ring binders and not enclosed around the edges. But that was a million years ago and I've never, never done this for my, my album. Except December dailies. I have some of those. Yes, I do. All right. So here are some Becky Higgins Project Life pages. And I've said before, I usually scrap 12 by 12. Uh-huh. All right, hang on to it, Jules. See the film on here? I don't like it. There's a film. So I'm gonna drag it against myself and try to get it off. I don't, I don't want film on my pages. Okay, we'll do that one that way. This is obviously not gonna be the first page of the album, obviously because it's a two page spread. Yeah, yes. I'm gonna stick them in here and I'm not gonna like it. 
because I don't like babies with dogs. <laughs> and I've described them as a necessary evil. Because that is when I think about them. I'm going to stick it in here. I'm not going to like it. But I am going to try it and see if it hangs off these rings and that makes me not like it. I don't know about this dog. It is humongous. I got the window open today. Not open. Yes, open blinds, open window closed. So I don't know what I think about filming with that either. Yeah, suddenly you just don't like this layout anymore because it's buried under a high gloss glare producing page, page, page protector. Okay. Obviously with just two in here, it's gonna hang a little, right? I'm gonna put it vertical. No, it's not hanging. Ha! Yay! Is it gonna hang? Can I just, ha! Huh. All my books over there are stacked on their side because, because I don't like the pages to hang. It seems like it's gonna hold it, hold it well. Okay, it's huge though. <laughs> but I want space. I don't want three pages per book. I don't. I can put that one picture in here that I don't like in the pink album. Is this three by three? What is this? Looks like, let's just see. Nope. So 3.75 basically, right? Well, let me see. Where is that picture? Um, what is this? A smaller, is it not? Maybe not. I think it was th about 3.75. It'll fit. I've got an arsenal of paint brushes and scissors over here and everything in there is, needs to be off to the side or I'll gouge myself in some absurd fashion. I'm gonna try, is that, okay. I might as well tuck that back in for the moment because I will lose it. Yes, I will. You're out of way to do it in a hurry. Okay. Are we going to uh, contend with each other all the live long day? Really? Okay, we'll settle you later. I'm not gonna do that for 40 years on camera. No, I'm not. Okay, get that out of there. Will this fit? Yeah. Okay, let me just stick it in there then. Is there no weird? Oh, hello. Hmm. Does this come out or no? Whoops, yes. It does come out. KK, also a film, rubbing it against my belly. To remove the film. Blowing it off, dropping it in the floor. Sophie's over there in the chair. Fast asleep. It's super precious. And this is always a feat. <laughs> Trying to get this uh, in here. Oh, this seems to be going better than usual. So this is what we get. And then we spend a hundred years making adjustments till we get it centered. If you guys have any sort of tips on how to make this a less obnoxious process, please do share. It's just hit or miss. I'm just, I kinda uh, moving around until, until I think I have it. It's already moved. That's obnoxious. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. 
Let me know if we're having fun yet. Because <laughs> I'm not. Yes, I am. I'm in the genie bottle. I'm having fun. Okay. I'm going to put it where I think it's center mass. Lightly. And see what happens. I'm going to act like this is going to work. My parents sent me a message um, like 7.30 this morning. I heard their, their distinct text tone and it alarmed me. I'm like, why, why so early? Is everything okay? Well, they had sent two videos and it was adorable. They have begun feeding birds again off their decks and um, and they had video footage Voila! They had video footage of turkeys, a pack of turkeys, standing on their railing of one of their ducks. Standing on the railing. <laughs> turkeys. Four turkeys. Yeah. So they've got, they counted 28 turkeys. This is in Minnesota. They counted 28 turkeys in their backyard yesterday. So... They're having quite the good time um, feeding the animals. Okay, so isn't that lovely? It's not. It's not too bad. I just not to drone on, but I don't like page. I don't like page protectors. So we'll try this album. We'll see. Looks like it's gonna stay in position. Very good. Now, where do you put this huge album? I have no idea. For the moment, it's stuck on my printer. Okay. Um, this is what I'm working on for my parents. Isn't it lovely? <laughs> I wanted to scrap their 80th birthday party. And so I got this album off Amazon. This huge sucker. And, um... I began with a subtle purple because their party was purple. Lavender purple. And so I began with the subtle purple and I spray painted with those, you know those, what are these? These, these sort of deals. And I spray painted with that and um, purple. And then the purple and the craft were very blah. So, then I used some washi tape under there in the beginning. And then the purple was just, it was all purple, gray, and blah. So I was like, what we need is some orange up in here. <laughs> so I added orange. And then I added all the other colors. And I was like, well, to quote my mother, if you're going to clutter it, clutter it. Um, back a million years ago when I was um, decorating my house. She's like, dude, if you can do it, do it. Don't half, half stuff. So anyway, so then I went all in with the bling. And this is what I got going. And it's an absolute mess. <laughs> so initially, initially, I was making them um, move my discard pile here. Initially, I was making them an 8 by 8 acrylic album. And then I thought, I've taken way the heck too many pictures to give them a scrapbook about their 80th birthday party in this little guy. A mere 8x8 acrylic. No, there wasn't enough room. So I was like, we're leaving off with this mission. And we're moving to a bigger format. So we're in a bigger format now. And this is where we are. And so then... I might end up doing, um, I might end up doing a, a hand, not handmade, a box, a special box to put this in because this cover is not protected. It's exposed to flinging hands and you know, I don't know. They could just set it on a coffee table, I reckon, right? Um... So I was trying to be irreverent, let loose, 
just don't worry about everything being just so. So I stamped on their picture. <laughs> to my eye, this is just a mess. It is just a mess. Um, that stays on ink. I don't like using it on pictures, you know why? Because when I do, it sticks and pulls and slides and it's just not a process I enjoy. So, but I did put stickers on, on there and thingies and I'm, I don't really like this layout. I just really don't. Um, I like this much better. Usually I'm just streamlined. Well, my go-to style is streamlined. I want it streamlined. I want a border or two and lined up just so and balance and symmetry typically. I mean, this is a lot for me to put together. You know, it's a lot. Mm -hmm. So I was in charge of decorating and this was at their house and the balloons were lovely. Party City did a good job blowing them up. And then, yeah, that's just, that's how that went. I think that's a Chamel collection thingy die cut. Is it? I think so. Let me check this out. And then, um, I probably took 62,000 pictures of the balloons because I thought it was gorgeous against, so their, their turkey crew hangs out in their backyard back here um and off they have decks out here out on the end of that side of the house and they were standing the turkeys on this railing back there this morning and yesterday but today my father sent a video of it to me <laughs> it was awesome I'm like you guys got it going on oh here duh you can see it here um let me move this see oh hitting the camera um, see the, the table here? You see the deck off beyond those sliding doors? They have bird feeders there. And turkeys were lined up all around on this railing. I kid you not. Cutest thing ever. Um, they got woodpeckers. They got everything going on. Okay, I like this because it's simple and striking and bold, so I like it. These bags I got at Party City, I was like, let's keep it simple. Just white bags, purple tissue, put your little bows on there, it matches, and you're not using tape and wrapping packages. Party City. Um, that's, the table was lovely. Okay. So I was going to give this book to them last week, but our trip got canceled to Canoe Bay because the girl here was sick and my husband was sick. So this is what that says. And these were the cakes before. And then I'm like, uh-uh, no, no, I could have made that. No, 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 no. What are you doing? And then I spoke on the phone with a pastry chef chick and she's like, oh, I'm so sorry. We'll do them again. Come back in an hour. And then these are the after cakes. And I was like, thank you, darling. Don't you think the afters are way better than the befores? Yeah. I was like, dude, uh-uh. I was going to let it go, but then I'm like, no, 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 no. I can't let that go. Cannot let it go. What else we got? What else? Pretty, pretty colors. Very, oh, I punched these with a punch that I have to stand on in order to get it through. To punch it, I gotta stand on it. So I, I get my picture just so, and then I stand on it, and I get punched pictures. See the little scalloped border? Ain't it cute? And then, 
there are their cakes, the after cakes, because the before cakes were, no, not gonna fly. All right. What else we got? Nice. These are stamps. I think these are wood, wood stamps from a million. There's their deck that they've got feeders going. And then these. Um, I don't like journaling boxes. They stress me out because I focus on making the page pretty and it's like, now I got to put writing on it. Are you kidding me? No. So lots of times I just write around the board of the picture and then people turn the book. <laughs> turn the book to read the journaling because it kind of looks like a frame. You know? You know? That's that's what I do. I made that doll for my mom. What I, what I mean is I customized that doll for my mom. It's American Girl doll. And I ripped off her wig, or my husband did, and I put on a replacement wig and gave her face up, and my mother was going when she spotted her in her living room on her shelf. And then my dad was handing her over so my mom could check her out. That's what was going on there. And same thing. I used washi tape to put my, her, um, secure her onto the page, her picture. I love that washi tape. Beautiful. What's Oriental? Love it. Uh, um, my father with his great granddaughter Violet. My mom with Violet. Okay. Mom with Violet. Dad with Violet. What we got over here? Um, this is in their living room. My mom was opening a necklace from Tiffany's that my dad got her. It's my son, Michael, the cider. And what else we got? Michael was, what was he doing? Michael was helping my mom adjust her purse that we got her, a little coach purse, and he was helping her. Michael is helping my mother with her new little purse. All right. Then, 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 and then. Then we got cake. My three sons. That's my baby boys all grown up. What the heck? Don't do that again. Don't do that again. And then, 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 and then. We have, I love this sticker. Love it. And then afterwards, the boys gave a concert. They have Michael's a singer songwriter in Nashville. And um, the boys have had a band, their own band, forever and ever, since they're little. Matthew's the drummer, guitar, guitar, singer, singer. And um, actually, they all play the drums together. It's cute. But um, they have their own little band. Then Michael moved away, and he's doing his thing. And these two are in business, and they have families, wives, and children. And Michael's doing his thing. Got back together for the birthday party and had a little concert. Um, complete with 50s songs, including what's the one you've lost a loving feeling and it was a good, good time. Scotty actually, Scotty sang like a rock. <laughs> they played like a rock. Bob Seger. It was great. I have the song list somewhere. I got to add, I got to add to this. Scotty took a picture of us listening to them. They had a good old time. That's Scotty. Grant, that's the father of the princesses. He has four daughters, three or triplets. Yes, yes, they are. <laughs> I didn't know Scott, Scott could sing. It's my first time hearing him sing. He sang Country Roads. What else does Scotty sing? Um, that's Scott and that's Michael looking up. Looking up the music. I love these letters. Um, let me show you the sticker book. It's very cool that I got them from. If you want cool sticker books with lots of variety, they have these on Amazon for relatively inexpensive prices. Things are falling over in the background. So I got stickers, they have letter stickers. And um, 
and that's where I got those stickers. Aren't they cool? For a K on its side? Dude, dude, yes, say yes to those sticker books. There's one more over there too. Anyway, um, the band, the audience, the singer, the guitarist, I guess that says fun, the drummer, Matthew. Um, my parents loved it. They loved it. There were tears. And so anyway, I got as far as this and I need to get further. Do I not? Yeah, I do. So Scotty took a picture of him, his brother, Michael. Scotty was sitting beside him. See him? And while Michael was singing, he took a picture of him. And he also took a picture of Matthew somewhere. And I have that somewhere also. I'm not sure where. Um, I'm going to write things here with, with um, black ink. I'm going to write there, stand by me. Lion sleeps tonight. Matthew did a drum solo. Sang Michael's. Michael did some of his songs. So these are my notes as I went through the videos to add to the book of the songs that we played. They played ZZ Top just got paid. That's a jam, dude. Oh, love that song. Anyway, that's the song list. I have, that's my notes. I gotta add to the book. And there they are cracking up. <laughs> Look at Matthew's expression here. He's, he's the youngest. Michael's oldest, Scotty's in the middle, and uh, cracked Matthew up. Their antics. What else we got? Um, just them playing downstairs. Um, so this is how far I've gotten. You know, the cough syrup I take, not to complain or anything, but the cough syrup I take is, uh, makes me nauseated. It's got codeine in it, which I don't like, but I'm so, it's a, it's a, not an anti-medic. It's not an emetic. Expectorant, Lord. Uh, it makes me, um, it helps clear out my chest, but it makes me a bit nauseated. So this is this book I'm working on, trying to live outside a box and scrap inside something atypical for me but this cover to me is kind of an unadulterated mess an unmitigated mess so what do you do i could tear things off i'm not thrilled with the first page and i'm not thrilled with the cover so great that's just real great how much how much time have i been yakking i was about time to wrap it up um this was me trying to be unconventional also. This is a book I'm making. Um, I stamped and embossed that and cut it out. I say that and suddenly I'm not sure about that information. Delete it. I, I could have, feels like I did. I don't know, suddenly. Tour paper, die cut hearts, inking, inking. Um, and that's what's happening. I like I like craft card stock backgrounds because I think it's striking for whatever you create. Isn't it striking? The black on that and the butterfly. I think that's Vicky Booten collection. Um, this and this. Not for that matter. Don't mark my words. Just don't. Um, this is some torn paper. Um, that I tossed in the trash and then was like, what are you doing? Use it. So I did. <laughs> I like it. I like the torn paper. I think it's cool. Um, some more torn paper. Wood grain. That's my son, my oldest son's song. One of them. So when it released, this is what happened. Um, this is a puffy sticker I've had for 32,000 years. These are Heidi Swap things that I've had since, what, 2005? Those transparencies. I thought it'd be cool to do um, his song with the Heidi Swap. And I used the Dymo to do the label of his song. And attached, touched that Heidi Swap. Touched it that way. Did some ink with the booper. 
think I just, you know what I'm saying? Twisted it. You know what I'm saying? Do you know what I'm saying? Let me show you. This just went like that. I was trying to mimic bullets. You know, round in the chamber, you get it. You get it. Okay. This is more I stock my son's Instagram. <laughs> and then I print, I print on this sometimes for fun fun because it's fun fun oh that's a die cut i've had thirty thousand years same as this and this i don't know if i stamped that and cut it who knows uh, michael's notes for his music how do you read that i don't know don't ask me um, he has a new release coming soon very excited what is this this is more of his Insta stuff. Oh, my horsey. My horsey page. <laughs> um, this, it's cute. It's very cute. Uh, I hand wrote, cut, I wrote that stole and cut it. That was fun. Pure joy. Probably did an exacto knife on that. And just hand lettered and cut and just, that's what I did. That horse was precious. Mm, a smoky kiss. I always gotta kiss animals cause, cause you do. I love this paper. It's a neat paper pad, super thick, um, thin, thin paper, but I love the designs, love them. So this was from that big honking paper pad. Uh, inside the genie bottle. This is, love that die cut. Love it, love it, love it. My Copics back over here. Dolls, dolls. Dolls, dolls. Uh-huh. Halloween, inking, stamping. That's all I got in there. So anyway, this this is was our neighbor. They moved away. We enjoyed her thoroughly. Every Halloween, she would swing, turn her head, and sing like, la, 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 la. La, la, la. She was the spookiest, creepiest thing ever, and she was our favorite. And then they moved away, and then she's gone. So sad. I used uh, candy paper for that. Some washi tape, some whatever. And that's what's in this one. But this pen I popped up, and so don't do that, because then you're going to have an alligator sort of problem. Alligator mouth, where everything, you know, you get it. Anyway. All right, that's the end of this video. I just wanted to share some things scrap related because I did, especially the page I finished and my new book and talk about scrapbooks. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you come back soon and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.